I think I counted 12 deer crossing signs on the way here. <laughs> Which is ironic because I counted 13 dead deer. So. <laughs> Apparently, the deer are taking these signs literally. <laughs> and they don't work because they never make it. Give them a break. Call them deer tried crossing signs. Something that maybe might give them a shot. Why? Because every time I went to, there was just dead bodies all over the side of the road, and you guys don't even notice. <laughs> Isn't normally a dead body on the side of the road a cause for alarm? <laughs> Not in Indiana. Oh, probably got hit by a truck. <laughs> maybe, but if there's a dear serial killer out there... <laughs> This guy's getting away with murder. It's the only thing I know that you can throw on the side of the road and it's less obvious. And it's always the little innocent ones too. I never see anybody protecting him, by the way. Where's the animal rights activists? Where are they uh, stopping and giving him mouth to snout resuscitation? <laughs> Come to the light! Oh, that's right, you got hit. Run from the light! <laughs> little deer paddles getting their little deer heart going, oh, I'm glad, I'm glad. Nothing! It's always the innocent ones. That's what I was getting at. It's always the little baby deer dead or the little mama deer, the fawn, or wait, no, wait. What's the baby? Fawn. What's, what's the mom? So does a deer? A female deer? Every time. Always a baby, always a mother. You never see a 10-point buck on the side of the road, do ya? You know why? Because a 10-point buck learns to send his family out first. <laughs> That's how you get 10 points. <laughs> hey, baby, it says deer crossing. Give it a shot. <laughs> <laughs> All right, son, let's go a little bit further down and see if we can figure this out. <laughs> All right, buddy, get on. <laughs> well, I'm going to need a new family next season, apparently. <laughs> I'll have 11 points by then. <laughs>